enough. We don't really need to serve our traditions of debt that tell us that life must be tough. At any time we can say there will be no more. We can embrace the idea of enough. We don't need to serve the economy of more. We don't need to continually enable greed. We can take a step back and take a deep breath and reconsider what we really need. But, some may say, what about all my rights to have all that I can purchase? You're certainly free to hoard up all you want, even if it does submerge us. Because we all must be beholden to all the free market offers, and we can only track and feel in control when we're exchanging dollars. And certainly times have proven how much gets done when we let money flow. But before we consume every morsel of life, Let's reconsider where we want to grow. Because our piles of garbage are growing fast, and they're filled with things that we've mined. People around the world dig through that trash just hoping that they'll find a treasure we discarded because we didn't know its value. But if we grew our sense of awareness, there's so much more we could do. If we grew our responsibility to the planet we inhabit, we wouldn't act so flippantly. We wouldn't have to panic. If we could grow our love for nature and remember we're part of it and realize how much it would behoove us if we could learn to love it, half as much as we pretend to love ourselves as we try to fill the holes in our hearts with commodities and consumables, don't you think it's time we start to honor our mother more than we have and thank her for how she provides? She gave us this little window of paradise, which is the only reason we're alive. The debt we owe her is more than the debt we've incurred in our voracious race for more stuff. The best way we can repay her is just to learn how to say, enough.